This video looks at the scoring techniques of Yuta Nakamura at the World Junior Judo Championships. So Yuta really likes this same side grip, often takes his grip over his opponent's head to grip the same side. He starts out with classical kumikata, then moves his grip to the same side as his sleeve grip. That scored Waza'ari. For me, it looked like two separate movements. I wouldn't have given that a Waza'ari. Let me know what you think in the comments. Now the Uzbekistan is trying to do a Sankaku Jime type strangle by pulling the sleeve under the armpit of Nakamura. Now the semi-final match was his most difficult one. It was against a Georgian. Often early in the careers of Japanese judokas, they have a lot of trouble with Georgians. And here, he seemed to take some damage. It took him a long time to get up from that one. Often when you're thrown from double sleeved control, the landing can be quite awkward. You can come down right on your shoulder. As he did there, shoulder and a bit of head. So one of the surprises for me at this junior championships is that the Georgians haven't really had their way of things when it comes to the Japanese guys. The Georgians have really put some impressive results on the board in international competition recently. This was certainly Nakamura's toughest match. You can see here He's had to go to this same side grip as the opponent's blocked standard grip. There, he uses the same side grip, two hands on the same lapel, driving through him for an Ochigari, and then moves to Tate Shihogatame for Osai Komi victory. Not really a surprise when the Georgian team is found a little bit wanting in Newaza. And then in the final, it's a fairly slow paced match until the end. So a very defensive contest by the judoka in blue. He went from the collar grip to the underhook very smoothly. A nice Uchimata there. The Japanese team is looking pretty good for the team's finals tomorrow with both of their heavyweights winning today.